Okay, what's up YouTube? My name is Galen and this is Galen's Gadgets. I want to thank you guys so much for joining my channel today. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to download third-party applications onto your Google TV or any other Android powered TV box. So um, there are a ton of different third-party apps that are just not natively available to these TV boxes or Google TV devices. So I'm just gonna show you guys how to utilize uh, third-party options that you could easily get online. In my opinion, it's a lot easier than Fire Stick or any of the other um, streaming type devices that you can download third-party apps on. So I'm not gonna hold you any longer. Let's just hop into this video. I'm about to be on Been on this mission since I first left home Packed up my bags like I'm grown Told myself to show myself to do no wrongs Like, I'm about to be on Been on this mission since I first left home Packed up my bags like I'm grown Okay, so um, honestly, third-party app support is one of the reasons why I consider the um, Chromecast with Google TV. Uh, there's the remote. Um, I consider it the best streaming box out there just in terms of performance to value. And this easy third-party app support, I definitely think it's the best um, streaming device out there. So it's the one I recommend above any other one. Um, the Fire Stick process, um, a lot of people have jailbroken Fire Sticks or things like that, but that process is honestly a lot harder than this one this one you literally have to download an app once and you're able to just send the apps to this app basically and you're good you got it downloaded on your tv i'm going to show you guys how to do that a little later but um some of my favorite third-party apps are uh tivy mate right here uh, this is an iptv player i use iptv personally because it's a little cheaper than cable so um i use this player to basically navigate all of the channels that i get through iptv i think this is this one has the best user interface and um, TV guide support. So uh, that's why I use um, TV Mate. And then um, another app that I use pretty frequently is Film Plus um, and uh, Cinema HD. I don't have it downloaded currently, but with those apps, I basically can watch any movie or a TV show that I choose. Um, again, this is a third party app. You won't find any of these apps on the uh, App Store. So um, yeah, that's why I'm making this video. I'm showing you how to easily um, download these apps from off the internet. So um, yeah, uh, let's go back a little bit. So the app that you'll need is this one right here. It's called Send Files to TV. Basically what it does, um, you could send any like uh, app link or um, app from your phone to this. Um, it's just a lot easier than anything you'll have to do uh, with a jailbroken fire stick or however um, you want to do it. But uh, yeah, this is the app. It's called Send Files TV. I uninstalled it just for this video, but um, it's readily available on the Play Store. J again, just search Send Files to, to TV. You want to download this on your phone and on your TV box. So I'm just going to install it now. Okay, guys, as you can see, I'm in a different outfit. That's because I had to restart this section of the video and the next section because I was having issues with my mic settings. So, um, yeah, I am back and I'm just going to continue with this tutorial now. So basically, um, the next thing that you want to do is download the Send Files to TV app on your phone. Um, it's a really easy app to use, and I'm just going to show you guys the whole process now. Okay guys, so now I am in the mobile app on my phone. Again, um, I believe this is gonna be the easiest way to send these uh, third-party app files uh, to your TV um, from your phone using this app and they're uh, using the TV app as the receiver. So um, it's very easy to comprehend. So basically um, you could either hit the send button and then choose the phone, I mean choose the file directly from your phone or what I like to do is I actually like to look up the file and then send it from whatever website it is. I'm going to show you how to do that now. Okay, so I found the app that I want to download from online. Again, this is a third-party app, uh, not on the Play Store or anything, so you have to download it from online. This is one of the more popular third-party ones. It's called Cinema HD and um, basically use it for free movies and things like that. So um, what I like to do, um, I just hit this download button right here. And uh, once it's downloaded, I go to the downloads on my browser and then I hold it. It's going to vary uh, based on if you're using Google Chrome or another browser, but uh, most of them you just hold and then you hit share. And then I'm going to go right here where it says send files. 
that's the app that we just downloaded and as you can see automatically my chromecast comes up um i do believe your uh you have to have the app open on the tv as well i'm going to show you what that interface looks like and we're just going to send it Okay, so now I am in the um, Send Files to TV app on the Google TV. Um, I don't need my phone anymore. Once you send it over and you see it on the TV, you are good. Um, so, yeah, once I did that, um, you just want to press on the link. You can see that's an APK file. Hit open. And um, it does give you this prompt um, for your security. Android does not allow your phone smart TV to install unknown apps, except for Google Play Store by default. You should allow your unknown source apps from your system settings. This is just like if you're downloading a third party app on your phone, you do have to go to your settings and allow it. So I'm gonna do that, install unknown apps, and I'm gonna allow Send Files TV to do that. Okay, so let's try it again. Okay, hit open and it's already there. Now let's just hit install. Okay, so everything is installed now. And as you can see, I got Cinema HD on my TV. Let's accept. And there we go. That is how you download third party apps into your Google TV. Again, that first step, you only have to do that once the step in which you actually download the send files to TV app. You only have to do that once. After that, you're good to go. You can look up as many APK files. I suggest Googling the best free movie apps or best um, free TV apps or any other type of um, file that you're looking for and trying to get on your um, TV, your Google TV. Definitely, um, you could download it from online directly. Um, there's also a pretty cool Xbox uh, app that you can download and um, get on your Google TV so that you could do remote play from your Google TV, from your Xbox to your Google TV. I think that's pretty cool. I may do a video on that uh, later. So um, yeah, if you guys have any questions regarding this process, feel free to leave it in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you found this video helpful and thanks for watching.